where Good Morning Warriors have got a brand new week is upon us, and it is time once again for praying for America. Servant of the Lord, Derek, and coming to you this morning. Let's go before the Lord. Heavenly Father, in the mighty and majestic name of Jesus Christ, the anointed one, and his anointing today, Father God, I come lifting up the United States of America into your hands. I thank you, O oh God, on today. Mm. That Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, you are moving mountains out of the way of this nation. And Father God, you are destroying every burden that has been placed on this nation and on the American people. Father God, I come today lifting up this nation, presenting America to you as, oh God, the sons of God today. My God, creation is waiting for us to manifest. And Father God, I say to you today, your remnant in the land are ready and we are in position to manifest. Father God, today in Jesus' name, I'm standing on Psalm 91. Mm. We dwell in the secret place of the Most High. Therefore, we shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord today, He is our refuge and our fortress. He is the God in whom we trust. I thank the Father God, you said in your word, that a thousand shall fall at our side and 10,000 at our right hand. You promise us that it will not, it shall not come near us. And Father God, this new variance and after another variance and then another variance that they are coming up with, Father God, I stand, oh God, on the word of God today and I push back in the name of Jesus Christ. I said America in Jesus' name is sealed and protected by the blood of Jesus Christ. There shall be no more variants in this land. I cast out the spirit of fear. I bind every variant in Jesus' name. And God, I loose, oh God, the Holy Ghost fire all over this land to burn up every sickness and every disease in the name of Jesus Christ. Father God, I'm asking you today, you who see all things, you who know all things, Father God, I'm asking that every direction, oh God, that they have intended to bring this new variant from. Father God, I close the loopholes, my God. I close the cracks on today with the precious blood of Jesus Christ. And I cover this country. I, oh my God, in Jesus' name, my Lord. Mm. I cover this land with the precious blood of Jesus. My God, because the blood still works. Because the blood still has power. I thank you on today that Jesus did not go to the cross and die for nothing. I thank you that Jesus was not kneeled to the tree for nothing. I thank you that he has given us our power and authority. Therefore, God, we come taking that God-given power and that God-given authority. And we pray for this land. We pray for this nation. We cover, oh God, from coast to coast. America is covered with the precious blood of Jesus Christ today. I give you praise for you are the mighty God. The heaven is your throne. The earth is your footstool. The clouds are the dust of your feet. Every time you move, the clouds, oh God, are moving. Holy Ghost, I'm asking that God, you will move today in America. Let us see the moving of the clouds all over this land. And as we go forth today, I'm asking you, God, as you did for the children of Israel, cover us with a pillow of cloud today as we go forth today God cover us with the dust of your feet cover us with a pillow of cloud cover us with the precious blood of Jesus my God mm. I speak, my God, to the life of every variant that has been created to bring harm and destruction on the nations of the world. And Father God, in accordance with the word, you said, resist the devil and he will flee. So I say to you, variant, we resist you in the name of Jesus. You demonic spirit, we resist you in the name of Jesus. And I say to Satan today, the Lord rebuke you, devil. The blood of Jesus is against you. America is God's country and no weapon formed against this land is going to prosper. We, the remnant and the land, are standing and we are pushing back evil in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, God bless America. God bless the families. Cover the children. Bless the children. Protect the children of God from ever sicknesses and diseases and from sudden death in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. May the angels give in charge over us be activated now because you said, because he set his love upon me. You promised us. You said, therefore, when I deliver him, you said, I will set him on high for he he has known my name. He will call upon me and I will answer him. You promise us that we will call upon you and you will answer us, answer us so that you said you will be with us in trouble. You said you will deliver us and you said you will honor us. Father God, I'm asking you today. Mm to deliver us and honor us. Deliver America and honor this land in Jesus' name. I'm calling for the shaking. The shaking you promised 
promise us, oh God. I'm calling for the shaking of the White House. I'm calling for the shaking of the Supreme Court. I'm calling for the shaking of the House of Representatives. I'm calling for the shaking of the Congress. I'm calling for the shaking, oh God, in our medical, oh my Sharaba Sata. I'm calling for the shaking, oh God, in our medical institutions all over this country. I'm calling for the shaking in the media. I'm calling for the shaking in the pharmaceutical company. Father God, all over this land, in Jesus' name, I'm asking God that the glory of God shall be revealed in America, and every I will see that when the righteous pray, everything comes to attention because God hastened to perform his word. He hears the prayers of his servants and he certainly answers us in our time of need. We give you praise, glory, and honor. We love you, Father, and we appreciate everything you do for us. We thank you in the name of God, the Father, Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God, and the Ruach Kedosh, the Holy Ghost. Today I pray in Jesus' name, so shall it be. Warriors of God, May God bless you. May heaven smile upon you. Have yourself a super blessed day. This is not the time to be lazy. This is not the time to fall asleep. This is not the time to wait for others to do the job. It is time for all of us to put on the helmet of salvation. All of us grab the sword of the spirit. All of us put on the breastplate of righteousness. All of us have the shield of faith. All of us have the belt of truth. All of us have our feet shot with the preparation of the gospel of Jesus Christ. And take this thing to the nations and the streets of this land. Praying for America because my God, nothing happens until somebody prays and we are expecting God to move in this land for the glory of his name until the next time. That's enough. Take care. Bye-bye.